Let's count down the top 10 rides at Butlin Skegness. Number 10 Santa Fe Express. No matter if your Butlin's getaway consists of taking a fly upon the paratrooper or having a truly out of this world experience as you head around the orbit, sometimes nothing is better than putting your legs up for a while as you kickily crack your way around the track. And that is exactly what Santa Fe offers amongst so, so much more, including the opportunity for two people to actually sit inside of a train engine itself, which in my does not only make the attraction even more authentically fun, but totally makes up for its very simple layout. Choo choo. Number 9 Carousel. Rocking and bouncing horses, spinning seats, and those non moving platforms have no doubt been encountered a few times before. And if seeing another one is more of a yay than a nay, did you see what I did there? Then you lot are in luck, with our next attraction being none other than a classic carousel. Nevertheless, even so, with Butlins having a few uniquer attractions, and let's be honest, it's not being the greatest of versions out there, our first Tom tip of the vid, my name is Tom, and these are my tips, would be to ride the ones you haven't done yet before giddying up upon these wild horses. Number 8 Go Karts. From a nice as you train ride to them bouncing horses to just now reach some crazy speeds as you manoeuvre your way around a special design go kart track, there is no doubt that our list is getting crazier by the minute. Yet, if you are crazy enough to drive in one of these cars, or to be honest, even crazier to sit in the passenger seat while someone else does so, get ready to move that wheel like you have never done before. With in addition to simply overtaking those friends and enemies, that special design track, yeah, that's the one that's full of many sharp twists, turns, drops, and bounces to throw you all off. Number 7 Rocking Tug. If you get seasick easy, it's probably best to look away now, because about to set sail what has got to be the roughest waters that you think he has ever seen is, you guessed it, the Rocking Tug. But do not jump overboard too soon, as if you are going to shiver your timbers for the entire one and a half minute voyage, sitting in the middle of a boat where the spinning is less significant than the back ends, which no word of a lie is only for the bravest and or craziest of sea captains out there, will leave you still dizzy, just not the mop the deck kind of dizzy, if you know what I mean. Number 6 Walser. Whilst on a rocking tug, you can escape the dizziness by following a very simple tip, fortunately or unfortunately, depending on how you found being sea bound. There is no escaping the full force of the waltzer, with in a nutshell you and up to three other people being sat within a freely spinning gondola that will then believe it or not be freely spun upon a spinning central plate that is then also bounced up and down upon a rugged terrain. Sounds crazy right? And that is without even a staff member manually spinning you around even more which you definitely don't need but may or may not happen upon your spin. Number 5 Trabant here we now are halfway through our list, and I think there is no more fun experience for this position than to take a ride upon a giant roulette board. Stand corrected, something madder than a giant roulette board, because yes, you get to choose your colour that you'll be sat on, and yes, you'll be spun around as much as the last two encounters did, but what you may not know until it's normally too late is that at the same time as doing all of this, you're also be tilted to a 45 degree angle and you do not need to be a jackpot winner to know that this is one crazy ride. Number 4 Eclipse. Now for anyone who does not know, a solar eclipse occurs when the moon passes between the Earth and the Sun for a short while. And whilst there's arguably not much more of a spectacular view than that, Butlin's very own eclipse is definitely a contender, with its multiple axes crossing on the path as it rotates around and around and around. And on ride does not disappoint either, with you then being able to sit on the end of one of these axes for a not too bonkers nor too tame experience, full of what I've got to say some of the best panoramic views across the resort's other rides. Number 3 Orbiter Who here has ever wanted to go into space? Well, of course you have, and so look no further up than the orbit, where rising, dropping, spinning, and bouncing family drop towers, believe it or not, are the total norm. Nevertheless, whilst it may be or may not be more freeing for the majority of astronauts out there, similar to Eclipse, it is all worth it when you finally get those incredible bird's eye views across the resort before plunging back down again to planet Earth in a matter of seconds, especially at night, 
if you do not fall in love with Vaz, then I honestly do not know what you will with. Number 2 Chair Plane may be another close home to experience then, because as you can most likely guess by the creative naming, but not truly fathom yet, our number 2 spot is a mix between both of a love child swing set and a plane flight. Thus, before we even get on to how this one of a kind journey feels, you should already want to climb aboard one of those singular chain seats. But hold on to that propeller as the real magic comes in when they then take off high into the sky, the wind begins to rush against your faces and you see each other's reactions, both good and bad, from the people next to you. Number 1 Paratrooper After a fantastic list of some fantastic attractions, we have now made it to our favourite ride at the park. And I know that as soon as you see the paratrooper soar through the sky, you'll very quickly realise why it's here. And so instead I'm going to give you one final Tom tip, and that would be to arrive to such major attractions earlier on. As amongst them picking up the longest queues as the day goes on, the last thing you want is them to break down before you get a chance to even take them on. Thank you all for watching, bye bye.